Welcome back YouTube. My name is David Mitchell. I'm the host of the Ace of Spades and as always I promise you no fluff so we're going to get right to it. So over the last few days I've been getting asked about the Uber and Postmates acquisition and I wanted to make wait to make a video because I um, wanted to just see how the details will plan out and what they would release. So Uber just officially purchased Postmates for $2.5 billion. And I want to begin by saying I think this is absolutely ridiculous because both Uber and Postmates are virtually non-profitable. Normally when a company does an acquisition, it's a textbook definition. Um, it's usually to make something stronger or more effective. But I don't see how a company that lost over $8 billion last year that goes out and spends another $2.5 billion on a company that's non-profitable to create a merger is anything of a smart business move. For starters, Uber's business model is easily duplicated and Postmates and Uber's as far as like customer service and branding and whatnot, it's been going through the tank. The main reason I'd say don't rush into Uber stock right now is because this acquisition is going to be an all stock sale. So I believe uh, Postmates, if, any, if I was uh, Postmates, I'd start selling as quickly as I can. This may cause a, a sharp dive as far as an Uber stock price. If I was Postmates, I definitely would do such a thing because the company is non-profitable, Uber is already non-profitable. Um, anything is possible. Um, traders could come in and create like a short term a short term run as far as to boost the stock price. But as of right now, with a company that has lost eight billion dollars and took on another two point five of debt, I would stay away from. I'm also really confused of how a company that pays its employees like trash um, could take on so much debt and lose money. But that's another video. Postmates is trailing behind DoorDash in almost every category. And I don't see how the merger with Uber is going to turn things around. Uh, maybe they can do something of like exclusivity or create like a, a partnership program where you get like discounts and make it dramatically cheaper than DoorDash. I'm not sure of the angle they're trying to get, but um, as far as two companies merging that both are non-profitable and losing billions of dollars, it doesn't make sense. I'll release another video later in the week um, as far after I analyze everything and with as more information comes out. But I just wanted to give this brief update just because um, I know that the merger just happened and it was, I'm just gonna track this very closely because I'd love to see their plan to reach profitability again. As always, if you received any value, please consider giving this channel a like. It helps the YouTube algorithm, subscribe. It helps us grow and let me know your thoughts as far as in the comments. I'll make sure I reply to you. And as always, happy investing and until next time.